Good luck. All of you. You all know what to do. later see if we can hit this train it's been a bad few weeks but Dutch being Dutch he is busy making plans and Dutch being Dutch those plans involve robbery and dreams well, I thought you was reading him his last rites now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respects, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. <laughs> you still here, then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. You want me to come? Of course I do, but... Look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. What? Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. Dang. Me. So John Marston was the main character in Red Dead 1. Abigail was his wife, that's his kid. See plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway man. Bill! Now, you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah. Come on. What do you want from me, Hosea? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living. Even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in black water. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just... I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly... We're Come on, man, let's rob a train. Choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutchie. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? Yeah, he's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to run. Let's go. Okay, gentlemen, listen up, all of you. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the O'Driscolls, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're gonna pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there that should give us good vantage. Charles, you'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, Watch you head it. straight for the back. Straight That's for the back. Mr. Cornwall's private car. Ooh. You me, Morgan? Great. Have you got a problem with that? Not if you keep your head for once. You worry about yourself, huh? Enough! After Bill blows the tracks, we're gonna need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep. Crystal. Yes, boss. Good. Now, come on. Let's ride. Okay. 
I gotta hit the back. Hit it from the back. They have a lot of amazing looking cutscenes. I wish they would speed it up a little bit though. See how he's getting on? Okay. Do I have to kind of ride down there or do I have to jump off the ledge here? Oh, I'm riding my horse. Good spot. How's it going, man? How you getting on? Yeah. I'm okay. You sure? Yeah. Of course. Can I help a little? Yeah. All right. Go ahead and set up the detonator by those rocks over there. Okay, sure. Now just unspool the wire and then attach it to said detonator. Jeez, but a little bossy trying to help. Connect the wire to the detonator. That should be easy enough. Can I speed it up at all? No. Nope. Hopefully I set it up correct. Okay, this is good. All right, that should do it. You head back up to the others. I got it from here. That was easy. Okay, boy. How did I get back? Yep. Here we go. What's going on? He says all fine. We'll soon find out. Everything okay? I think so. Okay, cover your faces. Train should be here any minute now. Let's 
rob this. Gentlemen, it's time. Good luck, all of you. You all know what to do. No, I knew it. I knew it was going to do this. No, my God. Oh, you have got to be kidding me. Where did you find that moron? You said it was fine. So it's my fault. Come on. You're pathetic. You know that? Why are we running after it? Why don't we take our horses? We literally have to jump on the train. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, he fell off. So it's gonna be me and this guy. Help! I got you. Now stop yelling. Oh, shit. Yeah, you're okay. Now let's go solo. Me and Lenny. Where's Javier? He fell. The others will get him. No, we need to stop this train. Sorry, mister. Dead air bar will refill. Knocking on it as well. Not in dead air. Okay. Holy shit. Oops. Beating this train engineer's ass. That's what I'm doing. Got it. First attempt at using Dead Eye. Headshot. I tried going. For it. Dang, I'm just keep hitting these rocks. At least I got two that time. I gotta learn how to do that. Who is shooting me? Where's the other guys? Let's get the money and go. 
We got some fellers holed up in this last car. Ah, shit. What are you boys planning on doing in there? Listen to me. We don't want to kill any of you. Any more of you. <laughs> I give you my word, but trust me, we will. I work for Leviticus Corps. Come on, boys. We got our orders. Okay. You asked for it. We ain't Five, opening this door. Four. Three, two, one. Seems our friends have gone deaf. Wake them up a little. That's enough. Mr. Williamson, give Mr. Morgan and Mr. Smith some dynamite. You two boys go blow that door open. Now, don't matter too much to us, but you boys in there might want to take a step back. Seems good enough. Here we go. Now light the fuse. Unless you got a death wish, I'd step back, fellas. Uh-oh. Come on, just walk on out here. <laughs> we don't want to kill you. My, oh we just want to rob your boss. <laughs> we just want to rob your boss. Search that train. <laughs> I want to get in there. Look at this place. It's like a palace. Now I've seen everything. Oh, you two got the safe? I'll search the rest. Oh, yes. Should be easy as cake. <sighs> You're just gonna stand there, kid. Pour me some brandy, will ya? Parched. Shut up. Me and Arthur did all the work. Yeah, kid did good. Didn't see you rushing to jump on that train. He's keen. I'll give you that. Okay. Let's see if we can get this open. Some brandy. Ha. Ha. There. See? That's how it's done. Shit. Just a pile of papers. Bonds? I don't think so. Here. Make yourself useful. At least we all know you can read. <laughs> Give me those. Imports from the Spanish West Indies. A lot of sugar. Some fancy new boat he's ordered from no, Europe. <laughs> I am not robbing another boat as long as I live. What did I get? Think I got him. Nice. Thank God. Come on. What did you find? These bonds. They worth anything? Oh, sure. Bearer bonds. I think we could probably sell these pretty easily. Well done. Now, would you get rid of all of this? The train? Yeah, uh, get it out of here. What about them? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> it's up to you. Kill them, leave them here, take them with you on the train. Just make sure they don't send no folk after us, okay? See you back at camp. I think I'm gonna have to kill him. We'll be moving on. The rest of you, let's ride. Okay, get on the train, quick. All of you. Any bright ideas? I kill all three. So behave. Come on, move. I hear so much as a footstep from this car. Oops, didn't even mean to do that. I thought we had a deal. Oh, I guess I'm shooting him.
Your action in the world impact your honor level and change how people in the world interact with you. Negative actions will make you dishonorable. Shit. Alright, I'll leave that guy. We'll see. See what he does. Not very honorable right now. That's for sure. Where are we moving this big bad boy to? Oh, we're just getting it out of here. I didn't kill one of them. This hell hole, we're gonna try. Weather seems stable. And we just robbed a Leviticus Cornwall train. We got money in our pockets. The worst is behind us, gentlemen. So the question uh, is, where now? I know this country a little. I told you, we should set up camp in Horseshoe Overlook near Valentine. We'll be able to hide out there no problem, as long as we keep our noses clean. <laughs> well then, let's go. Clean noses and everything else. Arthur, you're in that one. Bring Hosea. I know you two like to talk about the good old days and what's gone wrong with old Dutch. 